This is my P90 uh, Ruger 1022 conversion. Uh, many people have uh, never even heard of that the FN P90 before and discovered it in computer games such as uh, Call, Call of Duty 4, uh, Battlefield 2, and I think uh, Counter-Strike. It's a very unique gun and uh, ergonomic, very small, shoots a very small 22 caliber uh, projectile and uh, the, the real one has you know a 50 round magazine that the bullets as you probably know sit perpendicular to the to the barrel and rotate as they go in. But what this um, what I wanted to do I wanted to find a cool stock for my Ruger and as you can see there's the old stock the one below it is a, a project I, I just barely started on and I was gonna build an entire stock on a milling machine and uh, you know realize it was gonna be a heck of a lot of work and I the only reason I bought this this cheap well um, body was because it was to scale and I could use it as a three-dimensional uh, pattern to build my other stock but I, I soon discovered that um, the Ruger 1022 receiver and barrel would actually fit inside this little tiny uh, plastic air stock body and uh, took very little modification and it just it just barely fits in there it's such such a close tolerances but it's almost like it was made for it it's that it's that close now on the real P90 you have an injection port where uh, the spent cases actually fall out in this it just so happens that the magazine lines up perfectly with that ejection port right into the where it clicks into the uh, Ruger receiver there it's got a working safety it's got a red dot scope since there's no sights on the P90 on this particular one and then we got this massive dummy uh, silencer on there um, overall length is with the silencer is about 27 and a half inches. The weight is four pounds four ounces, and it is pretty well balanced. It's a little nose heavy. You can shoot it with one hand, um, left or right handed, either way. This is the about the only noticeable difference between a real P90 and, and this phony one is you know the charging handle for the 1022 and it's way back here the re receiver actually goes almost all the way to the back here so it's a very compact weapon shoots great um, and it's just a really unique uh, new weapon in my inventory I uh, hope you enjoyed this and uh, next video I might actually show you it getting fired